forget iCloud or Google Photos. You can automatically back up all your mobile photos, videos, media files, doesn't matter from iPhone or Android, to the Synology NAS DS1522 Plus and access them from your private cloud. All right, so first, log into your server account. Uh, from the dashboard, first go to the Package Center, to All Packages, and then search for Synology Photos. And then just go ahead, install it to your cloud. And after it's installed, open Synology Photos. Just swim through the first time setup initial prompts. Select enable the subject album, go forward. Now you will get QR codes to download the mobile apps, or you can just press start now. And whether you're from iPhone or Android, from Play Store or App Store, install Synology Photos app. Now the process and the app interface is quite similar for Android and iPhone. So even if I'm with iPhone, it can easily follow it from any Android. Now open the app, press accept the privacy services. In the login section, you gotta first put down your address or quick connect ID. To find it uh, from your server's control panel to external access, Make sure you're in the Quick Connect tab and that's it. There is your Quick Connect ID. And then put down your account ID and password. And finally, just hit sign in. Press allow full access if prompted. And then hit enable backup. And from here, just toggle on the enable button. There will be a few settings. Just check it out, like um, select if you want to backup new photos or all photos in your album. You gotta select the backup destination, either to the default folder, or you can customize, like create a new folder, and uh, select if you wanna save them into an auto-created year, month folder, so you can easily find them out. And after that, just go back and check the last two options as you like, and you're all set, just press done. And from this pop-up, press continue to allow access to all photos. And if prompted, just allow full access, especially if you're from an iPhone. And then press continue to enable notification. And once again, hopefully for the final time, just press allow. And there it is, the backup will start immediately. And if you go to the more tab, you can see the backup progress on your mobile device. And also, if you enter the Synology photos into your computer, you will see the backed up photos are appearing in there on your private cloud one after another. If you got some large files to backup on your mobile, you can tap on the photo backup option and then just enable focused backup once again. Now, this option is really handy, especially when at night you leave your device and just go to sleep. Your device screen will turn off and the backup will continue in the background. Okay, so once the process is done, it'll show backup completed. At some point, if you want to disable the auto backup process to save some storage space, just come back in here, tap on the photo backup complete option to the wheel icon and simply disable it. And whenever you want, you can enable it from here as well. And that's it for today. Thank you for watching.